I was blessed to have people that took that time to teach me, and I believe there's something important in teaching and, and pedagogy that, that helps kids uh, to get something, even if they don't ever really become like a, like what I'm doing, they're doing it full time, like I'm doing it, but if they get a love for music, they have a love for arts, it makes for a big difference in their lives and their educational processes and everything in there, just in the way they see the world, the way they view the world, because now they appreciate art, they appreciate science, they appreciate uh, everything that the world has to offer, they're not pigeonholed into one thing, they don't have a narrow mind of thing, but they're very open to everything, and music does that. My name is uh, Marana St. Hilaire, uh, some people call me Mo, currently my occupation is uh, musician, it's always been musician. A lot of the arts, I do video too, stuff like that. So editing, music editing, video editing. So self-employed, yes. <laughs> but still broke. Put Mike down. What else? I got Elvis up in this joint. This one ain't even cracked open. Gospel years, yeah. Hair, the musical. Just a good album. I haven't heard this one, but um, some other one about this one. She's good. She got some good stuff on here. This is good. This is good. Los Angeles Philharmonic. Um, I've been doing music for about since I was like eight years old. So roughly, I've been doing music now for almost um over twenty twenty some odd years. Cause I started playing drums at eight, and then after that, I went to the piano around like nine, ten years old. My dad put me in piano lessons. Start off with drum lessons. I was doing good in that. Then I wanted to learn how to play the piano. I see you have a bunch of different instruments. What instruments do you play? Like, what all instruments do you play? Oh, come on, man. <laughs> Don't do that to me. I, I try to... Uh, uh, I play the drums, I play the piano, I play the trombone, I play the bass guitar, the acoustic guitar, I play saxophone, I play trumpet, I play uh, baritone, um, I play clarinet, I can play the flute, I can play tuba, I played all of those instruments, play bass sax, I play tenor sax, um... Is there an instrument here I didn't mention? Okay. I play kazoo sometimes. <laughs> I got a little I got a little flute here that my sister got for me on a trip to the Bahamas one time. Yeah. So that was I, 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 I learned how to play that. That was kinda of fun. This is probably one of the coolest gifts she's ever gotten me, so I like that. I like that. I like to do stuff like that. So yeah, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, inch, I'm a music nerd. I, I, I admit it. I'm okay with that. What would be your biggest bit of advice? Listen, listen. Listen, listen to everything you can don't limit yourself to what you listen to listen to every style of music every type of musician learn everything you can about music just soak it up because there's so much of it out there listen to jazz listen to country listen to punk rock listen to metal listen to uh listen to smooth jazz listen to soft rock listen to indian music listen to Chinese, Vietnamese music, just listen to all of it. Listen to African artists. Listen to everybody as possible. And then after you listen, humbly go into a room and practice as much as you can. I could practice one note for 20, 30 minutes, just playing one note, because I wasn't in a rush, because my, my mindset was I want to be able to have a um, an understanding of my instrument. I want my instrument to become me, and I become the instrument. And so I do that with every instrument. This elect whether they're physical instruments or electric instruments like this, um, like these speakers and mixer boards, software. Those are my instruments. So I spend time with those instruments to get the sound, to get the quality, to understand what I want. 
and to be able to do it for other people. You ain't going to learn everything, but then humbly go and practice and understand and talk to people, understand what what culture, why a certain culture plays like this versus like that. And I think if you do that, man, the skies are the limit for a young musician because now you... You know, you're not thinking of yourself as you made it, but you realize that that music is an ocean of things, not a puddle, but it's an ocean of ideas, ocean of of possibilities that are out there that we're only still just scratching the surface of.